these are all these are judged and from mm -hmm. go on the other side here. Mm -hmm. You see the ribbons. And these were uh, this was a challenge class. They were all given the same plant, mm -hmm. very small, mm -hmm. and then they had two months to make it turn oh. into this. Yeah. And the one that one in the ribbon is over there. Uh huh. And then um, this over here is the. Uh, And here's the horticulture division. Oh. They were given the pots that are all alike. Mm -hmm. And then they were supposed to use gray foliage. Mm -hmm. And that one won. Oh, I thought that one. Oh, here, this one won. Oh, the blue's down here. But that one is a beautiful one. Mm -hmm. Yes. And you're sort of supposed to create a gray garden. Mm hmm. Hmm. In this pot. So this one won. Oh yeah. Which is nice. You didn't do plant. a great. No, I didn't do any of these out here. Plant mm -hmm. today for tomorrow, a garden in a pot. Mm. And then there are all of them. Mm, pretty. Very pretty. My protege. One of my protégés won all these blue ribbons because mm. out at, um, she has the Bell Story Farm, mm -hmm. uh, which is, well, it's called Rose Story Farm uh -huh. now. She's in the, this month's veranda uh -huh. and uh, this month's uh, Martha Stewart Living. Uh -huh. And she, this is hers, her first prize. Wow. When you say your protege, you mean she was your student? No, she was the one I put up for the garden club, so oh. I sort of oh. helped her along. But she's, and then this one was the one that we were supposed to have, have lunch with, oh. and uh, this green cowa. Mm -hmm. and, and she uh, won a blue ribbon? Yeah, she, mm -hmm. won, she won several over oh. there. Oh, wow. And I put her up the year before. How many can you put up a year? Just one. Oh. I didn't put anybody so up this year. So it's pretty exclusive. Huh? Very exclusive. Yeah. We have several, you know, Chris Willemson is president of GCA. I know. And then here's my picture over here that I didn't win a ribbon on. But uh, I think it's a nice picture. It's Which, New this Zealand. one? Yeah. Oh. But it didn't get a turn. See, it is dark. Yeah. Okay. What? Some of the lighting that they have helps, you know, they have overhead lights and they have. Yes. Great. This one did all right. She got the red in this class. Who got the blue here? Oh, yes. These are people who've never won before, mm. and uh, they came, I, they, they needed a specific rose and called me to find out where they could find it. Mm. And I said, right down the street from me in Carpinteria. So they went and knocked on the door, and the people said, of course you may have this oh. Joseph's coat. Oh. So uh, they did that. These are so beautiful. Aren't they wonderful? Yes. So, I guess it's the overhead lighting that does it. All these are so pretty. Mm -hmm. And it smells so beautiful too. Mm -hmm. The idea was a view into the future. Mm -hmm.
This is mine. Oh, how pretty. These are orchids, a oh, spider orchid. Beautiful. Wow. Oh, that's beautiful, Mary. So, well, thank you. Oh, I love it. And what about the vase? Is that the brazier in the bottom, you're supposed to incorporate something old in this oh, that's, glass. Uh -huh. And uh, it's a, looking towards the future. Mm. And mm. so, uh, these are the spider orchids. Mm -hmm. and, and didn't you say you have to see it from every angle? Yes. Yeah. through the heritage of the past. Uh -huh. What do they mean by mechanics? They mean the tape that I that you see that I have taped together uh, and I tried to cover it up but it sort of fell down. Uh, um, I covered it up with leaves. Mm -hmm. But I painted it black and uh, this little area mm -hmm. in here, that's, mm -hmm. it's, they're right, it needed some. I'm going to pull this up. And then there's one in the back that's okay. particularly good I want to show you. All right. This is the novice class here. And that one is so, oh, that's one the blue ribbon. That is beautiful. Particularly attractive. Wow. Lovely. She's a new member and she's terribly good. Mm. And then my rose friend, Danny Hong, got a special uh, oh, creativity beautiful. award for this. Yes. Mm. Hi, how are you, Joe? Good. Yeah. You know Joe. Of course. Glad to see you here. It's nice to see you, and this is some fabulous place, wonderful exhibits of flowers, it is. and the museum itself is so gorgeous. Oh, the museum is just a wonderful place. I love this museum. Yeah. Oh, it's I didn't play tennis. Did you go this morning? Yes. We well, had, uh, Sorry, this is my friend Jean Rajanier. Yeah, from honey, Vice thank Vice you. Ambassador Joe I'm sorry, Payton. hands full of everything. <laughs> and Joe, Joe Duff. Duff. Nice Hello. to meet you. Hi. And uh, Jean yeah. is doing a documentary for our 50th uh, Vassar reunion. Oh, and so oh. she's here photographing me with the flower shows and stuff. Oh, 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 it's, it's a fabulous oh, show. It really is. Yeah, I think some, done. Of the, the, some of these things are just so creative. This one, uh -huh. this new oh, lady, yeah. you know, April. It's oh, her name. She's good. And she is so good. I love her. I like her. Oh, she's charming. Yeah. We're going to go back and see the hats. Oh, oh the hats are wonderful. They're wonderful. All right. Thank you. I ran into my house. Oh, did you see Julia? No. Okay. I'm going to try to call her before. Okay. Yes. 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 Uh -huh. And we had all of these filled up. All the Empty pedestal there. So the information is still there. All right, good. Thank you. You're welcome. Now this one got the blue ribbon. Uh -huh. And uh, they brought this up from Pasadena. Mm -hmm. It's so fresh and so... Mm -hmm. Oh, isn't that wonderful? <laughs> that is amazing. And they made the hat. Oh, isn't that incredible? Oh, wow. Goodness, look at that. Isn't that cute? Yes. 
Mm. And then the one who won the novice award got the blue ribbon. Uh -huh. She's no longer a novice now, but she uh -huh. did this one too. I think this is the most charming. Oh, yes. I don't know why they. It's, she says, um, scale of accessories are too delicate for the design. Oh. This. Right. How, who's judging this? Well, These are they, Garden Club of uh -huh. America judges yeah. who come from elsewhere, not mm -hmm. from Santa Barbara, yeah. from Honolulu and uh -huh. Seattle, and they were all here last night. Mm. I don't think I agree with that comment. Mm. No. I think I don't think it's too uh, delicate. No. And then this is the last group down here. Mm -hmm. But this is all our Santa Barbara history, oh. you know, with the Asians who yeah. were here. Yeah. The Italian immigrants came. Oh. This shrine was once owned by the Santa Barbara Chi Kung Tong, the Chinese Freemasons, hmm. who were dedicated to the... Mm. And this was our pier, some of the big ships. Uh -huh. But I love that we had so many different immigrants. Yeah. Isn't it something? And I guess he must have had plenty of Span uh, Spanish ones. Too. Oh, yes, yeah. of course. Mm -hmm. Very important. They had land grants, some of those people. Now, this is one of my dearest friends. She got a blue ribbon, mm -hmm. Lou Greer. She's a national um, on the board of the Garden Club. Mm -hmm. So, um, now this I don't a... understand why that one got the red. Mm. But it did. This guy looks like Yul Brynner. Mm-hmm. What is this, Mary? Oh, this is, I guess, a Spanish altar mm -hmm. that um, was part of the original, well... It looks Chinese. No, it's Chinese. Chinese it's yeah. Chinese. Of course it is. There should be a note. The overthrow of China's last dynasty, the Queen. The shrine was carved in Kongmun, in a city near Canton, and arrived in Santa Barbara in 1898, when revolutionary activity against the Queen was increasing. Mm. The shrine represented a spiritual force which bound Tong members together. Mm. It is a long-standing Chinese community. Mm -hmm. And then after the Vietnam War, a lot of the Vietnamese came. Mm -hmm. They come to our farmer's market. Oh. <laughs> Veronica water. Oh, California natural spring water. Hmm. And then the earthquake that came mm. in. The San Francisco quake? No, the Santa Barbara oh. one had one. Mm. And so then all this, I think, was destroyed mm. in the 1905. This is the, was the Potter Hotel. It burned to the ground in 1921. Uh. But this was the grand hotel here, where mm -hmm. all the armor and the people from Chicago mm -hmm. stayed before they built their um, mansions. Their mansions. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Mm. Imagine wearing clothes like this. See this from the rear? Yes. <laughs> and the, even this amazing? one. Yeah. Yes, this is wonderful. It's a very historic.
historic town. Yeah, it certainly is. was completed, the design competition was completed just before the stock market crash in 1929. Mm. Quite impressive. Yeah. That's our present one. Uh-huh. Now oh. this is my grandfather, I think. Mm. Let's Where? See. I mean, he did this kind of oh. uh, illuminations. Let's see mm -hmm. who they credit with. See, Robert Wilson Hyde. Oh, and that was your grandfather mm -hmm. on your mother's side. Yes. Mm -hmm. And he started the arts and crafts movement here in Santa oh. Barbara. I he didn't was... know they had this here. Wow. Your family is so fascinating. You have such a heritage. Well, I really do, don't I? Yes, you certainly do. You've got a lot to live up to. Well, you've lived up to it already. Oh, bless your heart. Thank you. <laughs> but I mean, you I'll cover so much that. territory. You have Paris, Chicago, Sneedon's Landing, um, Texas. Yeah, Texas was the, the beginning of it. Santa Barbara, Los Angeles. Well, it's interesting how I came back here to my grandfather's Yes, friends. isn't it? And this yeah. is the first time I've seen yeah. this book. I'll show you some of his work that we have at home. We have it hanging. This is Pearl Chase, uh -huh. the first lady of Santa Barbara. Oh. I have to speak to Michael Redman. He's probably the one who put that book up there. But see, they started this arts and crafts movement. Mm -hmm. Attributes it to him. The mm -hmm. arts and crafts movement saw a revival of the medieval art form, a fine book production, and illuminations. Mm -hmm. That's what he did. Mm -hmm. These are not as good as the ones I have, so I probably mm -hmm. should give them. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm very proud. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes, it's wonderful. Now the rose riding groups that wear these. Things. Yes, and at the Rose Bowl they have those people too. Yes. The old Spanish days. Yeah, it's unusual. She's got the list of things. Um, that's what that is. Oh, I've heard of that, but I never saw one. But she always wins blues. Mm -hmm. So this is, like she said, but remember. Now, would you like to uh, go out? Can we go out this way again? Sure. Okay. This is the conservation. Because um, we're always supposed to promote the conservation. Mm -hmm. These are all native to Santa Barbara. Mm -hmm. Yeah, cute. never can tell who's going to have one that's in bloom and whose is not going to oh, make it. Yeah. These have all bloomed before. Oh. And so they just bloom too early. Yeah. And that's not their fault, really, is it? No. 
How long were you, have you been in the Garden Club here? Uh, since 1979, uh -huh. I think. So I'm still doing it. Yeah. And who proposed you? Uh, my neighbor across the street saw me out working in the garden oh. every morning at 7 o'clock, uh -huh. and she was president of uh -huh. the Garden Club. Oh. And uh, we had a wonderful time. She's no longer alive. Uh -huh. But uh, she and then a couple of other people who are now dead, mm -hmm. older people. Mm -hmm. And um, oh, I was the flower show chairman, uh -huh. the horticulture chairman, the special events. I did all of the, I've done about everything except being president uh -huh. of it. I haven't done that. The bulletin, the publicity, the conservation. Uh -huh. And uh, so I've been on the board a lot, but mm -hmm. uh, I'm usually not here in the summer, and so, you know, I've never been present. Yeah. Now, should we go? Sure. Have you ever seen that one? Well, I don't know. I, I don't think so. But you know, look at it. It's it's making a star. I can't see the VC. You want to look at this? It's making a star. See that? The what does light. that mean? Oh, yeah. The light. Yeah. Because I can't get the... It's we'll the we'll light. do it in the shade. Yeah. But she's in Los Angeles. And for, you know, fairly mm -hmm. long. Yeah. It's near the reservoir. Yeah, I know where that is. Do you like the ice? Yes. Okay. With your water. So do you think Nina will come back to another reunion, or did, did that do it for her? Um, she might. I remember her coming to that reunion. I think it was our, oh, 25th. was it? Yeah, yeah.
garden. And they love the garden, and they love the pool across the street, and uh, so they, uh, they appreciate it. I'm very happy. Yes, they're going to buy, uh, Helga Morris is a friend of mine who put me in touch with them, and she hopes to sell them the house. They're her clients. And uh, so they had wanted only to come for a month, and I wanted them for three months. And um, so we settled on two, because she said they couldn't do three, because they had to go to Cleveland. His brother is dying, and they want to be with start everything then. That's the day I leave to go. Then they'll go to Cleveland and take the library. And then uh, they'll only take July and August. But otherwise, we'll prorate it from the quicker with her, and then the other people will just go to the box. I mean, they should, anybody to, to know where he is or anything. And, uh, you know, if he gets into an accident, I mean, we won't find out. And he said, well, Amelia Earhart disappeared, and there was a great mystery about what happened to her. I don't know. Very sweet, I will. And we will be seeing each other on the 31st. So we'll speak that morning. All right, my best to Howard. Bye. Those are the people who introduced me to my beau. Uh -huh. Now here are these pictures. Oh, good. My brother. Where is Jill?